Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And this is for next seven days being recorded on the 12th. So you could say the 12th through the 19th, or the 13th through the 20th, or seven days from the date that you watch it, okay? Now keep in mind that not every reading is for you. This reading may not be for you, okay? Oh, we had a card flip over. Ram. Ram, a stubborn, aggressive person. So you may be dealing with a stubborn, aggressive person, or that could be you. So if you're the cross watcher, it could be your Libra. It could be an Aries. You could be dealing with an Aries. It doesn't have to be. Um, but there is a stubborn, aggressive person here. What else do we, and maybe, and it could be an Aries. So it doesn't have to be though. So what do we got for Libra? Oh, we got three that fell out. I'm going to go ahead and take them. Parrot. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. Interesting. Listen to that outside. Wow. Carrot. Opportunity or windfall. So you may be having, having an upcoming opportunity or windfall. This is going right above the ram. So I'm not sure if this other person sees you as an opportunity for money. That's what just came to me. Someone's gonna gossip about all your secrets and we have one more. Finger, warning you of a problem either now or in the near future. So there is going to be a problem either now or in the near future. It's interesting because the squawking stopped for now. Parrot, someone will gossip about all your secrets. Yay, yay, not. Could be an Aries, whoever this person is, is, if it's not an Aries, this is somebody that is very stubborn and aggressive. They're looking for an opportunity to take from you. What do we have for Aries? <laughs> Libra. I was looking at the ram. What do we have for Libra? Not Aries. Ooh, nine one one. Now, when I created this card, I created this deck. I was thinking emergency. So there is obviously numerology associated associated with that. Nines are closure, a need for closure. A need to close something. It's coming to an end. Ones are about independence. They're about manifestation. And your thoughts. Really pay attention to your thoughts at this time. Pay attention to your intuition, okay? Something to do with wedding vows. Wedding vows. So there's something to do with wedding vows here. Let's get one more. Ooh, we have a past life connection here. We do, we have a past life connection. So we do have a past life connection here. Warning you of a problem. There's a, somebody, there's a problem either now or in the near future. Could be two weeks from now because I saw that. So I'm not sure if you're dealing with somebody in two weeks from now that is taking an opportunity I don't know what this is. Um, there's a past life connection here. There's gossip. Fun, fun, fun. What do we have for Libra? Oh, we got two. This is, there we go. We got the Three of Cups reversed and the Magician. So the Three of Cups reversed is parting ways. It is. It's parting ways from a relationship, friends or family or a relationship. The party is over. There's a lack of emotional growth. It's a termination. There's nothing to celebrate. It's messy. Okay, this is parting ways, parting ways. Somebody is parting ways, they're taking action. The magician takes action, does something to create success, is willing to shed the old. So somebody may be parting ways from a third party. Just saying, there could be a third party where somebody's parting ways, they're taking action to do so. This is a golden opportunity, finding the resources to do so. Um, willpower as well, taking control, becoming highly aware. There's a divine connection to source here using manifesting there's definitely manifesting going on here um 
taking action, taking control, taking power. There's gonna there's some sort of separation with the three of cups reverse parting ways. Underneath that is the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could also be dealing with a Gemini. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Now, this is the basis of the reading. So this is somebody that is solid, stable, secure, hardworking, has some sort of stability. Um, very cunning, very clever, very grounded, very laid back, down to earth. So we have a very down to earth, laid back individual here who is very focused on financial security. Five of Cups reverse in the past, leaving the past behind, letting bygones be bygones, focusing on the future, because um, then reversed. But there's been some wallowing. There's been extreme grief, you know, prolonged grief. There's a need to focus on the future. I think that you're starting to focus on the future. You're taking back control. I don't know if you've parted ways from somebody, but that magician is taking action to create. It's... It is. It's be, I'm willing. I'm willing to let go of the old to bring in the new. I'm willing to do whatever it takes to be successful. World upright. So this is a major completion. Congratulations. Congratulations of some sort. You may even be putting, this could be some public recognition. You may be getting, doesn't mean that you're going to. Not every read, part of this reading is for you. This could be public recognition, but that is presently that's presently stepping into unknown territory right that cycle of your life is over the past is behind you putting the past behind you stepping into a new era right this is it this is it this is a whole new you it's a whole new you it's a whole new life it's a whole new journey that journey that chapter that cycle is over right now right now right now okay congratulations you've learned some sort of lesson that phase of your life is over justice in your future getting what you deserve a realignment everything turning out as it, as it should a a uh, decision going in your favor this may even be legal a legal decision that is going in your favor there's going to be a realignment something is going to go in your favor a decision is going in your favor and i want to say congratulations but then again, warning you of a problem either now or in the near future. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. We do have an opportunity or a windfall, and that would be the King of Pentacles. Somebody may be giving you an opportunity that is very valuable, that could lead to abundance, because the King of Pentacles does lead to the ultimate abundance. Very positive, believe it or not. We have the world upright, the magician upright, the justice upright, the King of Pentacles upright. There's a past life connection here. Somebody has manifested it. There's manifestation. This is a golden opportunity. You're going to get what you deserve. This is justice going in your favor. There's a realignment. Everything turning out as it should. Congratulations, whatever that means. The end of a cycle. End of a third party is what this is. There could be some news of legalities. If there is, it's going to go in your favor. Um, four of Cups reversed. Eight of Cups. Five of Swords. Oh no, it's actually the Seven of Swords. Just kidding, it's Five of Swords. I'm just being a smart ass. Anyhow, what else we got? Oh, now we got... Uh -huh. Seven of Swords. Everything that comes out of my mouth comes out of my mouth for a reason. People don't realize it though. They don't. They think, oh, but the, whatever. I, I can explain myself because I don't need to. Anyhow, Seven of Swords, deception, lies, not telling the truth, making a getaway. Five of Swords underneath it. This is pushing somebody away. It's eight of Cups underneath that, that's saying goodbye to an abusive situation, severing ties. Your person may be saying goodbye because that's in the outside influence. It's interesting because here we go. Eight of, eight of Cups, that is saying goodbye. That's in the outside influence. Whoever you're dealing with is saying goodbye to a situation that is emotionally disappointing. Um, I feel like you've been in, in some sort of power struggle or some sort of battle with an individual that definitely is stubborn and aggressive with that Five of Swords. This is somebody that has a hard time letting go of control. They've been, they have been, they, have, they, they are in a, 
you know, they don't like to back down. This is somebody that likes to win at all costs. We have somebody here that, I don't know if there's been, they've been staying in a situation for financial reasons. You know, they're very materialistic. They're very focused on money. And I definitely feel that way. I feel like there's going to be a change, okay? Um, somebody, you know, down here we have the Four of Cups reversed. And they, maybe they weren't interested or you weren't interested. Now they are. This is a new interest or and now I'm interested. I wasn't before. There was a missed opportunity. Somebody's taking the taking it now okay they're they're taking the opportunity that was missed they've been thinking about it a lot there's been some sort of struggle with letting go with walking away i feel like somebody's going to be taking their stuff and they're going to be leaving they're going to be going somewhere and they may i don't know if they're even forced to or if they're pushed away um they may be headed towards you you could be the one that's leaving i'm not sure um there's been a lot of grieving. There's been a lot of um, emotional disappointment here. Uh, action is definitely about to be taken. There could be even, you know, with the magician next to the justice, they're right next to each other. There could be, this could be legal action. I don't know if somebody is taking legal action. There's actually been some sort of abuse here. Five of swords, there's been some sort of abuse. I don't know if you've been, been hoping and praying for somebody to walk away from an abusive situation or somebody has been abused. They've been neglected. They've been lied to. They've been cheated. They've been, uh not taken care of there is definitely going to be some sort of getting away from it whatever that means getting away from the situation um finding a new approach seven of swords there's been some lies there's been some deception we have somebody here that is very cunning extremely clever um very good at manipulation this person has been manipulating everybody around them it feels like they're getting caught they're getting caught in the manipulation um saying goodbye, saying goodbye. Something has been ignored. It's like, it's been ignored, but the truth, the, the justice is the truth. There's truth that is being revealed. Okay, this is a new awareness next to the magician. It's an awakening and it's a wake up call as well. So somebody is getting some sort of a wake up call. This is the end of a cycle that you had to be in to learn some sort of lesson. And the world is mirroring the King of Pentacles. So this is a lesson about your value. It's a lesson about your worth, okay? Because that's the King of Value right there. So a lesson has been learned. And you are about to receive, because of that opportunity or windfall, you are about to receive an opportunity. Um, we have the Fool on the bottom. You could be dealing with an Aries. doesn't have to be. We have Libra here. We have a Gemini here. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um... The fool, starting over from scratch, stepping into unknown territory, uh, going someplace that you've never been before, leaving the past behind, leaving everything behind, taking a risk. This is exciting, doing something spur of the moment. Uh, this, is, this is impulsive, doing something suddenly. So that I feel like there's something that is going to happen. It's going to be very spur of the moment. Um, <laughs> Nine of Swords, and that has landed on top of the Five of Cups reverse. I think that we have somebody here that's been giving deep, deep, deep thought to a relationship, so it's kind of in the past. It connects with well, the Five of Cups reverse, the Nine of Swords, and the Three of Cups reverse. They're all touching. So it goes from this person has been giving deep, deep, deep thought to their relationship. They've been having a hard time sleeping, struggling, Really, really struggling thinking, thinking about their future, thinking about the the third party, thinking about their options, thinking about their choices, uh, really struggling. It's like they've become awakened, they've become aware, they've become aware. There could be even change in a legal contract here. Somebody may be changing a legal contract. This has to do with money for sure. Somebody has been in a situation just for the financial stability of it. This is like, and not seeing it as well, because it's like, this is all about the facts. It's all about the truth now. So there's some sort of, it's, it's like just going with the truth, just going with the facts. This is what it is. This is removing myself from my emotions and, and seeing the truth. You know, this is the truth. The end of a cycle. A cycle is ending. The cycle is definitely ending. Right now, very, if not right now, very immediately because that world card is in the present. This is the end. It's the end of a, of a phase of your life, okay? Something that really affected your life is coming to an end. 
you are about to, this could be a change of residence. It could be, it's, a, it's, a, it's stepping into a new experience. But that seven of swords is the overall outcome. That is, is like leaving and, and taking your stuff, you know, because that's what I see. And you don't normally see this with the seven of swords. This is what I see, okay? I see somebody taking their stuff, saying goodbye, looking back and just leaving the rest. It's like, you know what? I can't take it all. I can only take so much. Goodbye. You know, goodbye. So if, and then this is goodbye as well, okay? And, you know, this is goodbye as well. So we definitely, ha and so ain't the world card. We definitely have a big old goodbye here. We definitely do. But everything is going to turn out as it should. It's like it's going in your favor because justice is upright. A decision is being made that is going in your favor. There's been lies. There's been deception. There's been deceit, right? There even could be somebody that was stealing. Um, they're not getting away with it. I feel like we have somebody here that's gone through some sort of awakening with that magician card. And they're about to come clean. It feels like they're about to come clean. They don't want to fight anymore. They don't want to play anymore. They, they just, they start to see something. They've been giving deep thought to it anyway. This person um, is going to, and it could have to do with money. You may be getting a new job or an inheritance or, an, or money or because of that opportunity or windfall you're going to be getting an opportunity and that magician is a golden opportunity it is you're going to be getting an opportunity that you deserve because it's right next to that justice card six of pentacles reverse i was clarifying that justice card so there's this is greed I don't know if you've been dealing with a greedy person, somebody that is, there could definitely have been a theft. You know, somebody may have stolen something that was yours. It could be money, it could be an inheritance, it could be a job, um, or lied about something. There's definitely lies here. Somebody has lied. Um, this is an injustice. But there's a contract, just, it's going to go in your favor. So I wonder if somebody is taking something away, or they're letting something go, and they're giving it to you. Six of Pentacles reversed. There's been an abuse of generosity. This is like uh, somebody did not seek professional advice, but now maybe they've received some sort of truth or clarity or something like that. This could be a fraud. You got to be careful because right next to the Five of Swords, it's next to the Justice and the Five of Swords. The Five of Swords is betrayal right it is betrayal it's power struggles there's going to be a change because fives are changed there's been some lies there's been some deception somebody has been thinking and planning we definitely have a planner here they've been thinking a lot really especially at night about their future next to the five of cups reverse they've been grieving um I feel like a decision is going to be made with that justice there's been this is unfair you've been treated unfairly Whoever you're dealing with is, there's unfair treatment here, but it's going to, but things are going to change. It's like, it's, I don't know, maybe it's like a, what do you call that? I don't know if it's a 360 or what. Things are going to change. What is the seven of swords? Ten of swords reversed. There's suffering, a lot of suffering, pain. Seven of Swords, lying, lying about something. Somebody's been lying. This is reaching rock bottom. They've reached the end. They've reached the end. This is like liberation. It is. Ten of Swords is liberation. It's the end of a painful suffering. Somebody's been suffering. They've been lying. They, there's been lies, there's been deception, somebody's been lying about, maybe even about their health. I mean, I just got to be honest. This is something is coming out, maybe the straw that breaks the camel's back. This is the end, it's the death of a situation. Somebody is going somewhere, they're leaving a situation where there's a lot of pain or suffering or stress or it's like they're leaving that behind. They are. They're leaving it behind. This is too much. It's it's overwhelming. I don't know if there's been some cheating and the cheating gets revealed or lying or thieving, stealing. <laughs> Excuse me.
Wheel of Fortune. This is positive change. This is everything going in your favor. This is good luck. So something is happening and it is, it's meant to be, it's meant to happen. Uh, the end of suffering. There's been lies. Somebody has been lying, but the, it's the end. It is the end. We have a lot of big completions here. The world is a completion. Wheel of Fortune is a completion. Tens are a completion. We got the Ten of Swords. We have a new beginning with the Magician and the world. Wheel of Fortune is the end of a chapter. Luck is on your side. Being at the right place at the right time. Fortunate. Fortunate. I don't know. Something is happening. It's go definitely going in your favor. It's very fortunate. This is a change. It's is a change. Okay, it definitely is a change. Going in a new direction. Wheel of Fortune. The end of a cycle. The beginning of another one. Very positive. Fortunate. If, um, this is a blessing. Underneath it is the Six of Pentacles reverse. You weren't getting what you deserve. Somebody wasn't wasn't getting reciprocation, or they weren't getting what they were deserved. They were dealing with an egotistical individual next to the Five of Swords that doesn't care who they hurt. Was after the money. They were just after the money. There's going to be a change. It's going to be. I feel like there's severing of ties with that person. I don't know how that resonates with you. Wheel of Fortune. That is that is the wheel spinning and it's definitely going in your favor. Luck is on your side. I feel like somebody's taking their stuff and they're headed in your direction. And I don't I don't know who it is. Um, we have the Queen of Swords on the bottom. The Queen of Swords delivers the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. There definitely could be news of legalities here. Okay, there's some sort of truth that is coming out. Um, you're probably going to need to think fast as well and be open-minded to whatever this change is. I feel like somebody is coming towards you they are, or you're leaving. Somebody's definitely leaving, okay? They're leaving an abusive situation, okay? Somebody is leaving an abusive situation. They are now looking forward. They've been grieving. They've been grieving a lot. They're making a change. This is somebody that is doing it for themselves. It's like, I got to do this. I'm going to do this for myself. There's too much um, pain here. There's too much, I don't know, maybe somebody found out that somebody was cheating and that's the straw that breaks the camel's back or somebody was lying or they were just after their money. I feel like something is being revealed, okay? I feel like something is being revealed that changes everything. Um, and I do feel like there could definitely be a change in living circumstances with that world card, uh, change of residence. I feel like this is something that you have manifested through your thoughts. We definitely have your thoughts that are manifesting something, and it's definitely going in your favor this week. If there's any news of legalities, it's, it's, it's going in your favor. Um, six of Pentacles reversed, though, next to that justice. This is unfair. There's greed. There's selfishness. There's an abuse of generosity. There's a lack of reciprocation and rejection. Somebody may be, be being rejected because they've been lying you know they've been lying they've been abusive there's abuse here there's definitely some sort of abuse mental abuse verbal abuse neglect and it's been ignored up until now something like that manipulation i see manipulation just for the money doing it just for the money and realizing with that magician realizing the truth magician is right next to justice so that's like getting an epiphany, realizing the truth that this isn't fair. This isn't fair because the six of pentacles, the six of pentacles is right next, reverse is right next to the justice. This isn't fair, realizing the truth. So there's some sort of truth that is being realized and somehow it's going in your favor. So good luck.